Indiana University assistant professor uh, Paul Wright winds up doing a study on porn and how it affects the views of men towards gay marriage. That's really interesting, and I'm glad he did the study because I, you know, I'd be curious as to how it came out, no matter what. So let's uh, begin to show you some of the things that he concluded. Our study suggests that the more heterosexual men, especially less educated heterosexual men, watch pornography, the more supportive they become of same-sex marriage. Wow, isn't that interesting? Yeah, you know, I read a comment on this story, uh, a, th a fairly thoughtful comment that suggested. Uh, you know that obviously the people who watch porn are more likely to be more open-minded to begin with so there's not really a cause and effect mm -hmm. but I don't think that's true and I think what he touched on because everybody watches porn yeah. some people don't but few and far between and they've done studies the red right. states are uh, everybody, you know, most right. of the states that right. are in the top ten for porn watch everybody watches porn so then it becomes a pretty that's good like barometer the to measure. that's the balloon theory right so in this the, the more uh, suppressed you are sexually which we'd be in more conservative Christian uh, communities so you squeeze the bubble it come the, the balloon it comes out here right so you press it down they go to the underground porn right that's right when right. you try to when you criminalize vice or my or, or what that's what happens right it becomes underground be, that doesn't right. the problem doesn't go away right it goes right. somewhere else right so now of course everybody's wondering why and they address that too so the study also says pornography adopts an individualistic non-judgmental stance on all kinds of non-traditional sexual behaviors and same-sex marriage attitudes are strongly linked to attitudes about same-sex sex. sex. Right. So if, if you, you don't, if you think same-sex sex is gross, then you don't think same-sex marriage should happen. Right. Not and if you think it's okay, now look. So that's, that's not a hundred percent, of course. But I think, look, to, to uh, I think where you're going, Jimmy, I think they watch the lesbian porn and they think, well, they seem like lovely people, <laughs> right? They, like, oh, okay, and yeah. something, do you see what I'm and saying? Something tells them, well, if I think this is okay. Like I'm not watching the guy on guy porn, or maybe they are, but you know, then they think, well, then I can't have one be okay. It can't be okay for lesbians to get married and not okay for gay like, men to get married. Yeah, how am I against Ellen getting married when I just watched two girls make it out and it and it gave me great pleasure and you know and I obviously seem to be pretty okay with it, right? Yeah. I think that that slowly affects people. And it's not well, over. If you can watch yeah. the internet porn, which is far grosser than the porn I grew up with. Right. Uh, right, it's a very squiggly line. I'm against gay marriage, but I'm for double vaginals. I don't know, you know what I right. mean? It's I, like, I don't even know what that is, but it sounds really dirty. Yeah, it's, it is horrible. <laughs> right. But that's probably why they're okay with it, because a double thing, you have the PDPs touching each other, and uh, so there's a lot of guy-on-guy -guy contact in today's porn, is what I'm saying. Oh, that's interesting. I, I believe the study, and I, and I think it makes yeah. sense, and it, you know, and the, you know he, he looked at, you know, a decent amount of data, obviously, to get, to come up with it, and, and straight women are more likely to be in favor of gay marriage to begin with, straight men are less likely, uneducated straight men are even less likely, and so it's interesting because educated straight men were already on the all right path anyway to acceptance, etc. Uneducated straight men are like, well, I don't know about that, but instant southern accent, by the way. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I don't know about that, but I, know, you know, I like Sally and Susie, man, when they were, you know what I'm saying, with a double, double, double donger, and I was like, yeah, that's not so bad. Uh, yeah, I think I should let I them do I that right double donger. I think he said double donger. <laughs> I think yeah, I heard definitely double heard double donger. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I mean, that's a well known thing. <laughs> yes, it is.